Yeah, we'll we'll have to just see what this is what this is like. I just don't know. I think it's a I think it's best used uh I think it's best to use the uh, a, a controller for it. In the early 2500s, the humans just up and left. <laughs> oh. I will I will I will change this one. I can do this. I'm a big boy. Uh, stream info space otter. There we go. I guess things got a little hot and crowded for them. <laughs> I got it. Is the volume really loud? Really loud? I'll I'll change it as soon as I get some settings to change. Where they went? I don't know. <laughs> it's all good. Random game keys. Feels like you're going to get rickrolled any second. <laughs> it's true. Good riddance, I'd say. I, I, I get game keys. I don't know. I get game keys a lot more than I would want to. For a while, it was nice having the run of the place. But the thing is, <clears throat> it just kept getting hotter. And otters? We're way too much fur for that kind of heat. It was time for us to skedaddle. Some otters a lot smarter than me built a rocket from stuff left behind by the humans. <laughs> otters. Space Mission Alpha, they called it. <laughs> Streamer. <laughs> Streamer Flex, that's right. It's, turns out getting to space is hard. At least nobody was on board that time. So they tried again. Mission Bravo. Gravity won that time too. At least the crew made it back down safely. But they kept at it. And the third time, Mission Charlie. Well, they made it. Just barely. We made it, I should say. Into space, that is. No map. No fuel. <laughs> Just three otters floating through the void. Looking for a place to call home. I expect we're going to die any second. Is this out <laughs> This is out of wilds. Charlie, Jesse, sensors indicate an abandoned ship nearby. They might have some fuel we could use. Let's send the kid over in the L pod to check it out. That sounds way better than drifting aimlessly through space. I'm in. Cool. Outer wilds. <laughs> Getting around in zero-G is easy, but it takes some getting used to. You can practice on your way to the L-Pod. Just push off in any direction and you'll float until you hit something. Give it a try. Whoa. Easy, and I like how these mag boots attach me to whatever I land on. Tutorial. Take a few more jumps and grab that jetpack. That's <laughs> right. I can't believe I missed it. Hey, Jesse, I found the jetpack. Now, how do I use it? Tutorial. Hold down A to thrust. While holding down A, you can steer with the L stick to change directions in the air. A. Here we go. Nice. Oh, this is kind of cool. I, I see what's going on here. Bop. Watch your fuel. You can only use the jetpack for a short time before it needs to recharge. Do me a favor, will you? Fly around and collect all those energy pods in the next room. Roger. Name's Jesse, kid, not Roger. Ha! Good joke. It's a good joke. Okay, space out of Charlie. Kind of, kind of interesting. <laughs> Jump onto the side. Of, what did it say? Oh, I see. It. I think I got it. Ready for an advanced move? 
Hold right trigger when you land on a wall to slide along it. Landing on an angle lets you slide further. This curvy hallway is the perfect place to practice. Cool. Into the L pod. <laughs> no, they're just from New York. L pod one to wrap control. I'm approaching the HMS Tomcat. Copy that. Looking good, Charlie. Docking procedure in T minus 60 seconds. Um, Jesse, shouldn't I be slowing down? I'm coming in a little fast. Listen, it's all good. Oh yeah, that. What Jesse is trying to say is that there's a little problem with the docking clamp on the L pod. Good night, boys. Good night. Sleep well. I'm a little put out that you haven't hung out with them all day. So I, I told them that you're on you're on playtime duty tomorrow. Mwah. You Yay. bet. You bet. Show them your growing bald spot. Have you seen They're my growing bald up spot? There. <laughs> I know because I cut the hair. Good night, little Good editors. Night. Oh, they got their fleece. That's, the a, I, that's a new <gasps> game, Daddy. It is a new game. You got it. Good night. Love What's you. that? Sounds like a good time for you. There isn't one. What? How am I gonna dock with the Tomcat? Buckle up, kiddo. What are you saying? Okay, well, simply put, ramming speed. What? Ah! It's Miss Tomcat. <laughs> ah, bang. Charlie, are you there? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay, I think. You could have warned me before I got in the lander. That's a bad idea. That which doesn't kill you only makes you stronger. Charlie, see if you can access the bridge and power up the ship. Once the lights are on, you can start hunting for fuel. Blind rival, how's it going? Get the feeling I don't want to uh Oh, gun! Hey, Jesse, I found some plans here for a laser. Can we build it, can we? Looks like you'll need to find some parts first. See what you can find on your way to the bridge. I'm on it. It might help me clear away some of this debris, too. A laser. A laser. All right. I, I, I'm, seeing, I'm seeing the appeal of the game. It's, it's kind of cool. The graphics feel a little bit, um, oof, I bonked my head, it looks like. Graphics feel a little bit um, more cartoony than I usually like. <clears throat> they're not bad, but they're just a little little bit, a little cartoony for my taste. Not saying that it's, yeah, like I said, not bad. It does have some chill beats, you are right about that. Question is, where do we go from here? So there's puzzles. Here we can go to bridge here. <laughs> the tunnels. Oh wow, there's fire. Build bot. Oh, that's what we're gonna use to uh, we're gonna use that to build our laser. I'm sure. I 
I mean, I like the I like the mechanic, the flying around mechanic. Like it feels a little funky to start, but but eventually you kind of get used to it, and it's it's kind of cool. Basic laser, build it. The most basic weapon an otter could ask for, capable of clearing small debris and damaging small enemies. The key word here is small. I did it, I did it, I, I built a laser. That's great, kid. Tap X to fire the laser. Ooh, ooh, okay. Space rats! Star date. Thursday, 2219.4.1. Space science log, Carrie Rodentia. Looking back, maybe it wasn't the best idea to bring rats with us into space. We thought we'd be great test they'd be great test subjects for our zero G experiments. At first they were perfect. The rats adapted to space more quickly than any of us expected, and then some escaped. Ooh. Okay. <clears throat> Crab, how's it going? We got some chill beats. Looks like I found the bridge. Nice work! Now find that power switch. Should be pretty obvious. I need a beer, is what I need. It's 8 p.m. and I need a beer. <laughs> Quite badly. It's it's not it's not acceptable not having a beer at this point. Power systems online. Rodent elimination protocols engaged. Hey, whoa! What? Turn the lights on. Turn the lights on. There's a map. A map. Hey. Okay, there's a little little map. A little map of the world. I've marked the location of the fuel canisters on the map. There's one right in this room. See if you can find it. Remember, you can view the map at any time at any time with Y. Okay. If you can't have bourbon, beer will suffice. Started Subnautical Below Zero today, and I'd love to see how you handled an ocean exploring survival game. Oh my goodness. I'm certain <clears throat> that I would not handle it well. I'm certain of that. Because, boy howdy. I'm, uh, I'm not, ooh. Five fuel tanks, okay. For more physics fun, try shooting in different directions while you're attached to the crate. Ooh, physics fun. Right. It's like a propellant. It's like a propellant. Oh, nice. That's a, that's a eye that would normally, like, watch me. <laughs> Picked up the, sh the plans. Shield upgrade one. <clears throat> cool. Nice. Sake. Nice. You slept very well. I bet you did. I bet you slept well after that. That sounds sounds very, very, very pleasant. Science report. I've been fascinated by historical reports of Earth's wildlife. This report collects interesting facts about the extremely cute marine mammals known as the sea otter. Otter fact one. Sea otter's pups are so buoyant they are unable to sink or dive underwater for the first couple months of their lives. That's actually awesome. <clears throat> if that's true. I think, it, I think it might be, though, right? Why would they lie to me? Why would they lie to me? I ask you. Uh -oh, oh, I see. Got limited time to get, get over there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are those are these some of the small enemies? Ah, da, those guys don't look friendly. I thought you said I was alone over here. I believe I said there was no organic life on board. Those drones are clearly not organic. This just keeps getting better. I don't believe he means that. I believe he is upset with his friend.
Whoop, bop, 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 bop. Okay. <laughs> the best kind of correct. <laughs> to the engine room. Whoa, whoa. Oh, oh, ouch. Ouch. So this is kind of this is kind of cool game. I mean, I'm not I'm I'm not saying it's not cool, but I'm also saying that it's I don't know. I don't know what it is about it. The area system has been more effective than we expected. The rat population has dropped dramatically. Ares has taken over many of our ship's robots and turned them against the rodents. Sadly, today we have had a non-rodent casualty. Ares incorrectly identified Monty, one of our lab monkeys, as a rodent. Poor Monty. <laughs> Ooh, ouch. Ouch. Whoops. New location discovered. Orbital training. Aha! Oh, oh. There we go. Uh-oh. 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 Okay, it's fine. <clears throat> yeah! Three of the five fuel tanks. Glorious. Okay, I don't think we can go that way. Not meant for us. Okay, we'll play this game for a few more minutes, I think. We'll get past the, <clears throat> the kind of initial... Oh, ouch! Okay, watch out, watch out. And then there's another game I wanted to try, a little bit more similar to uh, Hades. That looks pretty cool. Her butt. <laughs> it's correct. That is correct. Okay, so we need to find a way to get through there. Whoa. The kids told me Got that. Zapped. The kids said that I'm a worse flosser than you because it hurts when I floss them. And then I was like, it doesn't hurt when dad flosses you. And they're like, no, it does. You're both bad. Like, so you just wanted to disparage me, and, and they're like, "What's pretty much?" And then I was like, "Good night." <laughs> what's what's disparage? What does that mean, mom? Disparage me, mom. Mama wouldn't disparage me. Name for thing. Thanks for following. Space rats! We have at least two dozen rats floating through the Tomcat ventilation system. They're chewing on all kinds of hoses and cords. We need that stuff to breathe up here. Today, Miss Dr. Nim, ah, Secret of Nim, you guys catch the reference? Mm -hmm. Decided to train the Tomcat's AI system to identify and eliminate rodents. The new system is called Ares, Advanced Robot Elimination System. Hope it works. Yeah, I'm sure it works all right. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Hey, 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 now, come on. Come on now. Last one. Oh, you love to see it. That's great. That is just great. Cool. Ooh, aye. Sliced otter butt. I thought about that time. Okay. This is the correct way. <clears throat> so it, it seems like it's going to be like a, a, a physics 
a light, physics light based puzzle, puzzle game, right? It's pretty, pretty cool. I mean, I don't think the game is out yet. I think it's still early access. I could be wrong about that. Secret of an Imp. Oh, very, very creepy movie. I, I loved it though. Did you know that that was that that movie was made by um, some some people who used to work had worked for Disney and were like kind of sick and tired of the way Disney was doing business. And uh, ooh, ouch! And so they made they decided to make their own cartoon that was about heavier stuff. I thought that was kind of interesting. It's a little annoying that you can't move. Dang. Okay. Yay. I, I should have used the crate too. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so we need to use this thing. Travel time very quickly went from 120. Oh, did you? Is it? Is it like a daylight saving time thing for you? Daylight saving time for you. Oh, like each of those. Each of those scraps are individually interesting. Interesting. Build bot. Oh, shield upgrade. Yes, I will take a shield upgrade. Oops. Hey. What gives? Okay, I guess I can't change direction with that thing. I can only change direction with the other thing. Oh, I see. You haven't found the navigation data yet! We need that too! The data should be nearby. Keep looking. Sheesh, so bossy. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and... that box to block the uh, the fire wait that won't work that won't work we're still gonna get Ouch. Oh, I see, I see. This. Ah ha 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 ha. A secret. <laughs> totally. It's totally the great. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Nice. I thought I was supposed to avoid the grate because it was gonna like, whoa! It was gonna like fire a bunch of enemies at me or something. A sea urchin in space! An urchin, bring it back here. I'm starving. Jesse, Charlie is doing all the hard work out there. You're just sitting around the bridge. He needs the energy way more than you do. Charlie, pick up the urchin and mash X to crack it open. I predict a huge boost in energy. That'll help with these annoying drones. <clears throat> yes, it will. 
Rust upgrade one. Oh, right, because otters eat sea urchins. Mega. Look at that. Look at that. That's awesome. Woohoo. Nice work, kid. You found everything. I've overridden the lock of the docking bay controls. Head to the docking bay. We'll pick you up. Roger that. Oh, I didn't realize I could... I gotta go through the gate great again. Okay, can we build this yet? We can. <laughs> so what's this? so what's the next game <laughs> exactly attempts to shut the area system down have all failed the system is classifying more and more creatures as rodents artificial intelligence more like almost intelligent the captain has ordered an evacuation until control can be reestablished i've been reassigned to the orbital command training facility work on the practice drone guidance system okay all right uh, let's see. I just want to, I want to finish this section. Oh, it's a boss. Rodent intrusion detected. Welcome to your doom. Well, technically I'm not a rodent. I'm an otter. So can we skip the doom part and just open the door? Prepare to be lasered. Why are we shouting? Uh oh. What am I doing? Oh, I see. Assuming I need to break open all these grates and then... But now I don't know that. Yeah, there's so many sprockets. Some bopping music, that's for sure. Now, are we like supposed to wait for it to like? There we go. It's still long enough. Oh man, poor fella's getting hurt. He's getting getting hurt real bad. How dare you destroy my shields? <laughs> Said he's not an otter. <laughs> oh. Why is the computer mad? He thinks I'm a rodent. Or it thinks I'm a rodent, I should say. They think I'm a rodent. Seriously, you can stop yelling. My drones will annihilate you. Or will they? Or will they annihilate you?
Launch more drones, dude. I need your drones to hurt you. Oh, I see. Sorry. Whoops. Here we go. So yeah, <laughs> it's oops, definitely it's definitely an interesting game. I don't know. I don't know if it's for me. Soldier on ah, <laughs> a riveting boss fight. Oh shoot. Okay. It's it's you know it's it's cool, but it's a little bit. It feels a little bit. Um, I don't know. I don't know what do you guys think. <laughs> I don't know what to think about it. Kind of like uh... it's not as interesting. Slow and floaty. It's it's yeah. It's slow. Insolent badger, you have not heard the last of me. It feels a little bit like. Um feels a little bit like what they would do in like a Mario game, right? Like it's it's got like a very Mario feel to it. Too mobile game like. I I I feel that. I feel that. Do I look like a badger to you? I'm so out of here. Oh boy. And now and now the computer is crying. Somebody somebody get some tears. Uh well, somebody get some tissues. Oh yeah, traps remind you, Mara. It's weird. It it is. It's different. Floating plants now. I said it should be fun. So it's sort of like it's like a it's like a, a met maybe like a Metroidvania a little bit. It appears this design requires a highly volatile element called flectomite. Head back to the ship now with the map data you just found. We can plan our next move. Watch that. Okay, cool. So we got through got through the first little bit and the first. Uh, First boss fight. There we go. Fresh out of tears here. <laughs> this is fine for some gamer uncle and niece and nephew time. <laughs> right. Uploading to SpaceNet. Uh oh. What are you? What are you? What are you laughing about? That's what I'm wondering about. Okay, we got a hub. With the fuel you found, we are just able to explore without worrying about getting going adrift. I concur. Nice work, Charlie. Now let's see what else you collected out there. All right. Sky dead. <laughs> That's some fine work, boy. I've got some ideas about what we can, what we ought to do with this stuff. Oh my gosh. While I'm tinkering, chat with Ada about what we ought to do next. <sighs> Is that joke, is that joke gonna, is that joke gonna keep coming? Coming? Becky's phone is in here. Bring in. Too many puns, I reject. Well, I mean, using the same pun, literally one line apart, is, like, is too much. Oh, that was in here? I kept calling it, looking around How the were you house calling for it? it? I called it from Alexa. Oh. I called it, looked around the house for it, and by the time I got out from my Alexa in the bathroom out here, <laughs> I, someone had turned it off. Yeah, because it's in here.